Caribbean has a 94.29 literacy rate with a very loyal workforce and companies that hire Caribbean nationals who experience a 95% retention rate. 82.3% of the Caribbean's workforce has advanced education. Tens of thousands of these well-educated Caribbean people migrate across the world every year and are making positive contributions to the diaspora they are moving to. With a cultural affinity mainly to the United States, the United Kingdom and Europe, Caribbean people not only speak the language but also understand the culture and they are enterprising, multilingual and are making a significant positive impact wherever they go. Many island governments invest heavily in their education systems, and the region has some of the highest literacy rates in the world, according to the World Population Review. The Caribbean education system is mainly based on the United Kingdom system, which is ranked number 10 of the best systems in the world. It may have some flaws, of course, but it is a valid and long-lasting structure that most Caribbean countries have embraced for decades. Every country in the world has the power and authority to choose how to manage its own education system, typically under the direction of a local ministry of education. Some countries, of course, are more efficient than others in this. While the best school system is generally the one that understands how to reach its students and create passionate and educated individuals, it's hard to define a universal system that works for every population on the planet. Some of the Caribbean countries on our list are ranked among the countries with the highest literacy rates in the world and have some of the most sought after students, schools and universities. Let's take a look at the top 10 most educated Caribbean countries and their best universities. Please like, subscribe and turn on the notification bell for our future videos. Number 10. St. Lucia the mountainous island of St. Lucia seems to keep steady on the educational pattern. The literacy rate of the island, which is today at 90.1%, has been around this average for quite a few years now, ever since a bigger boom in the 1990s. The gross enrollment data on literacy education are still low, around 15%, and there is a huge discrepancy between male and female enrollment, with the latter group ranking over double to the first one. Number 9. Jamaica The land of wood and water, beautiful Jamaica, has a literacy rate of 93% as of 2022. There has been a consistent increase in the past five years thanks to the efforts of the Ministry of Education and a number of students from other Caribbean countries moving to Jamaica to attend the renowned University of the West Indies, Mona Campus, based in Kingston. The UAE is proudly ranked number one in the top universities in the Caribbean, a truly excellent choice for any student. The path is still long, but the island is improving its status and is currently number 138 in the world. Number 8. Dominica the so-called Nature Isle of the Caribbean, named after the day it was allegedly discovered on a Sunday, Dominica in Latin, by the Italian explorer Cristoforo Colombo, is one of the poorest islands in the area, with an economy mostly depending on agriculture and unfortunately positioning in the very center of the hurricane belt, at the far eastern edge of the Caribbean. Its dramatic beauty, due to the massive presence of tropical rainforests, united with the niche culture of the Carib people, makes it a very unique place. As a matter of fact, this is the only island that maintained a percentage of the population of the native people of pre-Columbian descent. The island counts mostly primary schools, only one teacher training college, and a medical school. Its literacy rate today is at 94%. Number 7. Bahamas One of the richest islands in the Caribbean, the top one per GDP among the Caricom Islands, Bahamas is number 7 on our top 10 list and number 97 in the world rankings as to its literacy rate, which is 95.6 as of 2022. The massive presence of international schools such as the Lyford Key and a satisfying 92% attendance rate both contribute greatly to the higher placement on our list. On top of these factors, the University of Bahamas, based in Nassau, offers both undergraduate and postgraduate degrees in several different fields.
Number 6. St. Vincent and the Grenadines This major sailing destination, a friendly country with a relaxed and peaceful atmosphere, has a current literacy rate of 95.63%, ranking number 96 on the world scale. While high-end tourism is a great presence and a source of economic relief in the country, the poverty rate still remains quite high. The education level is also affected by this, and the enrollment into tertiary education is currently only around 24%. The most interesting university in the country is undoubtedly St. James School of Medicine, an international medical school founded in 1999 that has a current enrollment of almost 1,000 students. Number 5. Grenada the island of Grenada, the Spice Isle, is a very interesting entry in our top 10 list. Its literacy rate is at 96%, placing the country at number 92 on the world's list of literacy rates. Its level has remained steady in the past years despite the economic difficulties of this country, whose economy is largely based on tourism and education still holds a priority position in the government of this island. Grenada is the home to St. George's University, an international medical school considered nowadays the largest provider of medical doctors into first-year residency programs in the United States of America. It currently counts almost 1,000 residences in 2022. Besides its reputable institution, Grenada is famous for its School of Veterinary Medicine, one of the very few in the world to be accredited by both the Royal College of Veterinary Surgeons in the UK and the the American Veterinary Medical Association Council on Education in the United States. Number 4. St. Kitts and the Nevis With a current literacy rate of 97.8% as of 2022, this country takes a wide step into the excellence and leaves the others far behind. No longer known for its sugar export business, but rather for its tourism-based economy, St. Kitts and the Nevis is one of the richest islands in the Caribbean community and common market. With high levels of education, stunning landscapes, and a very low crime rate, this place is an expat paradise. This also justifies the strong presence of international schools and universities, Universal Caribbean University, the International University of Health Sciences, and the Medical University of the Americas. Universities in St. Kitts and Nevis are known for their modern methods, high-tech learning tools, and innovative approach. St. Kitts and Nevis is number 73 on the world's literacy rate scale. Number 3. Trinidad and Tobago Nicknamed the Rainbow Country due to its extreme demographic diversity and most famous for its economic wealth due to natural oil, gas, and fossil fuel reserves, the dual island of Trinidad and Tobago ranks number 53 in the world with an outstanding literacy rate of 98.97 in 2022. Its flourishing economy has guaranteed higher levels of education to its population and to several expats living there, which justifies the higher number of international schools as well. Education is a high priority in the country's government and economics. And while it is compulsory and free until the age of 15, many Trinidadians continue into upper secondary or tertiary school. University education is also free, but only at approved institutions such as the University of Southern Caribbean, the University of the West Indies, St. Augustine Campus, or the University of Trinidad and Tobago. Number 2. Barbados if there is a Caribbean country whose government heavily invests in education, that's Barbados. Education is a top priority and is entirely run by the government. Barbados benefits from one of the highest literacy rates in the world, ranking as the 23rd country in the world with the highest literacy rates, with a whopping 99.7%. This is an extremely successful and progressive country, home to one of the world's top 50 universities, the University of the West Indies. Faculties hosted in the Barbadian campuses include law, social sciences, humanities and education, science and technology, and medical sciences. The gross primary enrollment rate is above 90%, while the tertiary enrollment rate is currently at 65%.
If you find the information in the video useful, we would greatly appreciate it if you would give this video a like. Thank you. The number one most educated Caribbean island is Cuba. With a 99.8 literacy rate, Cuba ranks number one in the most educated countries in the Caribbean and number 22 in the world. Its educational system has been highly ranked for many years, especially after the 1959's revolution. The Castro regime improved the education of the population by creating a nationalized, government-operated system, which is today still receiving high political priority and economical focus. The Universidad de Havana, founded in 1727, appears 51st in the Latin American University rankings and the oldest university in the country, but not the only one. Other Cuban top universities include the University of Cienfuegos Carlos, Rafael Rodriguez, and the Universidad de Oriente Santiago de Cuba. The largest Caribbean island is known for exporting excellent doctors to the rest of the world, while international students come to Cuba mostly to study medicine from the USA, the UK, the Caribbean, Central and South America or Africa. Excellent alumni of various Caribbean universities populate hospitals and medical centers all over the world. Since education determines not only a student's success, but also the future success of a nation, it is clear from this list that countries with a wider perspective and vision of education, which invest more in their people's education and believe in its power, are set for great things in the future. The literacy rate is not the only fact determining the positive outcome of a country's education system, as the quality of education plays a huge role in it too. The pandemic has highlighted gaps and the need for more modern and technological approach. Great educational revolutions are still taking place in the Caribbean and these numbers might drastically change very soon. Please like, subscribe, share our channel and turn on the notification bell for our next video as we explore the rich Caribbean cultures together. This is Jairi Caribbean. See you in the next video.